You guys, this is so amazing. I'm having the best ice cream right now. I am eating my face off. <laughs> now that I don't have to be a size zero in a movie, I don't, I never, no one ever said I had to be a size zero. I just chose to. And also my friend said, my friend who's an agent at CAA, she's smart and beautiful. She said, after the war, there wasn't a lot of food. So that's why people were skinny because I was working on a period piece and all those actresses were so skinny. So I was like, well, I want to be like them. But also because the writer, the writer, he's so sweet. You guys, the writer of the movie was so sweet. And that's why I did the part because I fell in love with the part and I fell in love with the movie and the writer who wrote it, obviously. He said, now only if we get you down to a size zero. And I thought about it and I was like, you know what? I can do it. I can do it. The writer asked me to and all those bitches, actresses from like the 30s, 40s and the 50s were a size zero then I can do it. So you know what? I will do anything for film and TV, just not in real life. I will torture myself every single day for film and TV, just not in real life. I would rather be tortured every single day knowing that I get to go to set and do what I love for a movie any old time. But you know what? Eating this ice cream is so freaking good. This is a New York company, Ludwig's. No. I don't even know how to pronounce the name. How do you pronounce the name? I'm not even going to try right now. I've had a couple glasses of wine. <laughs> Van Lugan. Van Lugan? Van Lugan. That's how you spell it. Van, Van Lugan. That's how you spell it. That's how you pronounce it. Van Lugan. Have a blessed night, y'all.